Welcome to North of the Broad. I'm your host, Karen Wyman, coming to you from higher ground on Ladies Island. I'm joined this afternoon by Allie Cadmus from Technical College of the Low Country. Hey, Hi. Allie. How are you doing? I'm good. Welcome back. Thank you. You are the Director of Recruitment and Admissions for the Technical College of the Low Country. You guys have a lot of stuff going on. Yes, we have a jam-packed uh, spring coming up. So we have a lot of open houses that are going to be happening in the next month or so. Um, March 14th, we have a health science open house at our New River campus in Bluffton. Mm -hmm. And then April 4th, we have an open house for our Business Industrial Technologies and Public and Human Services at Beaufort. We have another health science open house on the 11th of April in Beaufort. April 25th, we have a Latino open house at the Bluffton campus. And then we will be having another open house in May on the 30th, which will highlight our transfer programs and our dual enrollment programs. And oh. that's going to be at the Bluffton and the Beaufort campus. So a lot going on. You're a busy lady. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> that's good. Like really good things happening yeah. at TCL. So Yeah, we want to highlight all of our programs and just make sure everyone's got an opportunity to come to all and, our campuses. And really just make the community aware of, of all the different programs that are offered at Technical College. Yeah. Um, when is registration for your summer and fall 2019 open? When can people start to do that? March 25th. So if they want to, they can apply now um, and get the ball rolling, get all their uh, admissions paperwork completed with us. And then once March 25th opens up, they can start getting registered for classes and they can register for summer and for fall at the same time. Excellent. Um, why would someone choose to come to Technical College of the Low Country? Uh, first and foremost, affordability. Uh, the price tag at TCL compared to other local colleges is, um, you know, you can't beat it. And to be able to just even just come and get your general education courses mm -hmm. and transfer somewhere else, just come and get a certificate uh, and then go into the workforce right away or get any of one of our numbers of degree programs. I mean, the opportunity to, to walk away with limited student loan debt <laughs> where some people it's yeah. astronomical. Yep. Um, it, it really will go a long way for a student uh, in the future. I agree. Um, and, and how can one apply if, if you have a student at home, um, maybe somebody who's um, ready to finish high school or someone who finished high school and didn't go right into college and now they're thinking I really need to take that next step in my career, what's the easiest way for them to apply? Uh, go online to our website, uh, www.tcl.edu slash apply. The application's free online. It's very easy to complete. It'll probably take you about 10 minutes. Uh, and then they'll just follow up with admissions uh, and financial aid for, for the remainder of the process. Right. So if you're someone who's sitting back thinking, you know, I know that I need to do this for myself to further my, um, you know, my career aspirations and my future, but they're just really concerned about that financial burden. Um, they can go online and apply for financial aid as well. Correct. They can do what's called the FAFSA, so the Free Application for Federal Student Aid, mm -hmm. and the keyword is free, so it's a, a free application online. Uh, it'll make them eligible for uh, loans, grants, and uh, different types of scholarships for state and federal uh, aid, and you go to FAFSA.gov. F-A-F-S-A.gov. Yeah, I've done that before, and it is a tongue twister with, yeah. without, without a doubt. Um, Allie, while we have the time here, tell us about some things that are new and exciting at TCL. I know that I see blips all over the place about things going on in your New River campus and in Bluffton. Mm -hmm. And I mean, there's always something new and exciting. I'm sure that the public is interested in hearing what some of those are. Yeah. Um, well, you've probably been seeing in the paper a lot talking about our Culinary Institute yes. of the South, which is going to go into the Buckwalter Place right over by that huge new Kroger that's yes. going <laughs> in. Uh, we're extremely excited about that. Dean. Um, uh, Chef Huff, he's mm -hmm. our Dean of the Culinary Arts Program, has been doing a great job of letting the community know what's going on there. But it's going to be a culinary institute with an, also an interpretive museum with, which will highlight uh, southern food, southern cuisine, such as you know, Gullah cuisine, mm -hmm. seafood. Uh, but we're going to be teaching certificate degree programs, summer camps, uh, c continuing education. So if you just want to come in and take a pastry boot camp, you can do that as a member of the community. My husband would be thrilled if I ever yeah. cook something. <laughs> so we are really excited for that building to, to go up. And uh, classes should be starting for the certificate, even though we don't have the building yet, uh, come this summer. Wow, uh, that's and then fast. We, yeah. Yeah, so we're trying to get the ball rolling with those students. And time frame on actually having the new facility um, open? That I do not know okay. the answer to. <laughs> so uh, we're just kind of waiting on other things. But um, we also started a public and human services. We have a pre-police academy. So for individuals that 
um, are looking to go to the police academy. Uh, we're the only school offering it in the state of South Carolina, and it's a way for them to uh, get themselves completely prepared to go into the law, police academy yeah, and law, law enforcement. enforcement. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Well, always something exciting. We look forward, Allie, for you to come back um, in the fall once you've got some more information for us. But I yeah. hope you guys have an awesome uh, turnout at all of your open houses. Thank you. You're welcome. We'll be right back with our next guest on North of the Broad. <laughs>